Hi, welcome to Excel Video 57. A little easier video today, just some basic things I want to show you, um, some tricks on conditional formatting. Here is a spreadsheet that I've shrunk down so you can see I've got all kinds of conditional formatting going on in this screen. You see a bunch of different cells, color, and different things going on. If you want to quickly find out all of the cells that are conditionally formatted on a sheet, let me show you how to do that. On the main home tab, there's a find and select, and underneath here, there's conditional formatting. And as soon as I select that, you can see that these cells, it's a little bit tricky to see because it's just a light blue color that they do, but these cells, these cells, all this, and these are all conditional formatted, and it's very easy to find them. The, the other thing I wanted to show you while I'm in here is you can also find all the formulas on a page, you can find all the comments on a page, all the constants on a page where you actually type in 312 as a constant. All those things are available in this Find and Select menu, but that's how you can find conditionally formatted cells. Let's assume that we found them, and you know what, we really don't want these conditionally formatted anymore. Um, for whatever reason, I don't need it anymore. Here's how to turn it off. You go to conditional formatting after you highlight the cells you want, and then we're going to come over to clear rules, and clear rules gives you a couple of choices. You can clear the rules from the selected cells, the ones that I picked over here. You can clear rules from the entire tab, the entire worksheet here. Uh, if I had a table, you can clear the rules from a specific table or from a specific pivot table. But if I click clear rules and from selected cells, now when I go to find conditional formats, I find all this, but I don't find that because this cell is no longer conditionally formatted. There's how to find them and how to clear them. Easy lesson for today. Stay tuned next time, and we'll get something a little bit more complicated. Thanks for watching.